It's Friday, October 1st, 2010. I'm Jeff Bacalar, and it's time to get loaded. HP has chosen a new chief executive. After spending 20 years at software maker SAP, Leo Apotheker will take the reins at Hewlett Packard. While Apotheker's appointment was somewhat surprising to the industry, experts say his experience could revitalize the company and help jumpstart HP's smartphone initiatives with the recent purchase of Palm. The Stuxnet computer worm that infected an Iranian nuclear power plant may have left a biblical clue about its origin. Deep within the code is the word Murdis, which can be alluded to Esther, possibly connecting Israeli involvement. With that said though, Israelis are not saying whether or not Stuxnet has anything to do with the country's new cyber war unit. The Google URL shortener is now available to anyone, and not just through the Google toolbar. Goo.gl will allow for data collection, including when, how often, and from which computers users are accessing URLs. To test it out, head on over to Goo.gl. And finally, on the day the social network hits theaters, Facebook has unveiled a handful of photo improvements to the site. Users can now share high-resolution photos and bulk tag friends. Also, the photo browsing experience will be upgraded, ditching the current setup, and it'll allow for a much more streamlined presentation. Those are your headlines for today. I'm Jeff Bacalar for CNET.com. You've just been loaded.